Hey there everyone, WTF Sexy Headphones here. Um, Stalker is giving me a lot of problems and I don't know if I'm going to get an episode up tomorrow because literally the mission inside the kindergarten, once I go save the one guy who's chilling in that cabinet area, like literally the moment I say let's go so we can get out of here, it crashes every single time and I've tried kind of just reloading and hitting it seeing if it was a fluke and it crashes every time so so there's just some issues with it and I'm trying to figure out how to fix this one um, I'm gonna try and update my files a bit and hope that it doesn't corrupt my saves I'm gonna try and um, backlog my info so hopefully because I'm terrified of updating to the latest versions because I'm so worried that there's gonna be an issue that's going to corrupt my saved files and like we're like what two three hours away from the end of stalker it would be it just kill me if my if my saves got jacked and I had to start all over. That would be awful. Like, I'm terrified of that. So that's why I haven't been updating to the latest versions, because the one that I've been on has been working pretty decent all the way up until Perpiat. Perpiat sadly seems to be an issue, but it's been working pretty much the whole entire time up until now. And I haven't found a fix for this yet, so I'm going to try and update my files and see if it fixes it and try and back up all my files I have right now. Um, but I haven't done that yet, and it's a lot to it's a lot to download, and I'm not sure uh, I'm not sure how long it's going to take. And I gotta re look through what stuff I need to I don't know what stuff I need to download and everything. So I gotta work on that because right now I can't get anywhere. I've tried multiple times, and it's just, it just just crashes every time. So I'm going to work on that. In the meantime, though, we're getting towards the end of Stalker, so. I'm going to need to start thinking of another Let's Play to do, and I have an idea! Um, I think I'm going to choose three games. Um, you guys can throw your suggestions out there, though half the time you suggest games that I don't own. But if you guys want to throw your suggestions out there, don't suggest Fallout. I'm not doing Fallout. Maybe in the future, but not now. But anyway, if you guys want to throw suggestions out there, especially if you know what games I have, by all means, go for it. Um, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick three games and I'm going to do a part one to each one and post it on my channel. And then I'm going to have you guys vote on which ones you like best. I don't know when that's going to start. Um, I might make a vlog just to announce it because I might do it this week, depending on if Stalker gets fixed or not, because I don't want it to be like a dry spell of a week. But so I might do it this week. Um, fuck, I'm gonna have to install a lot of shit though. But uh, so but feel free to suggest any games that you want to see me do a Let's Play on down below, not Fallout. And I'll see what I can do. But I think that's how I think that's how I'm gonna do it. I think I'm gonna do three like a beginning part to each game. And then you guys can watch them and be like, you know what, this is funny, like, let's do this, like, oh, this game looks cool, let's do this one. And I'll let you guys vote on which ones, or which one you want to be the next Let's Play. And still, I have not been able to match up my time with the dentist, and he's been busy, so we still haven't done Dead Space. I'm gonna have to beat that boy into submission. That's just sounding kind of strange. And I'm gonna have to be like, hey, we need to kill aliens together, let's do this. Um... That's pretty much all I have to say, so I'm trying to work on fixing Stalker, and I'm trying to fix this, um, what's it called, this crash that keeps happening, and then we gotta think of a new Let's Play and shit. Oh yeah, and you guys, I have 3,000 subscribers. I might as well announce it, because I've literally gotten like five messages like, hey, 3,000, 3,000. The fact that you guys notice this every time before I do, like, what, what, why? How do you guys do it? I don't understand. Maybe, well, maybe it shows up for you guys. It doesn't show up for me unless I click on my channel, which I don't frequent my channel because I don't have a need to like click onto like the profile of it. But anyway, but you guys always seem to notice this, and I got like five messages like, "Hey, guess what? You got three thousand subscribers, three thousand. So I'm happy to have all you guys. You guys are awesome. 
yeah, let's, let's keep up the good work. I don't really have anything much else to say to it. It's just exciting, I guess. I pretty much every milestone, every tiny little milestone I hit, you guys like to like to remind me of and be like, guess what? Guess what? You guys are so cute. I just love you guys. You guys are adorable. But anyway, so that's pretty much it for now. Um, and that's all I got to say. So I'm going to probably do that Let's Play thing this week. Um, but I got to try and figure out Stalker. And if I figure out Stalker first, then I'm probably going to be playing catch up with that instead. But you guys know the general of how it's going to go. I might... Yeah, and if I do post them up this week, next Monday, I'll be like, hey, like, you know, go look at those. Go watch them. Vote for what it is that you want. But I'm going to try and wait to see what you guys suggest. Um, I'll tell you some of the things that I'm thinking of off the top of my mind. Um, I'm thinking of maybe one of the fear games... I'm thinking of maybe cryostasis. Um, I think that's as far as I got, actually. Maybe, like, the fear games or cryostasis. I haven't thought of other ones yet. <sighs> yeah. Anyway, so that's pretty much that for this one. And I'll keep you guys posted on that. And if you don't see any stalker up, that would be why. Because I gotta try and fix it. Because I cannot get past this crash. Normally the other ones I can get past. This one, not so much. Anyway, let's move on to story time. This one was when I was really young. And uh, my parents, you know, whenever they'd go to the bank, they'd go through like the drive through area. And that's how I always known it to be. Well, one time my mom needed to go into the bank uh, for whatever it is that she needed to do. And I had a cash, or I had a cash, I had a check that I needed to cash. I think it was for my birthday or something to that extent. And when we're walking towards the front of the building of the bank, I look at her and I'm like, mom, where do I cash my check at? Because, you know, I've always known like, oh, we got to go cash your checks. Like, let's go through the drive through. And she pointed. And to me, it looked like she pointed towards the drive through area. And I was like, looking at her like, do I really just walk over? I didn't ask. I just was like, do I really just walk up, like up into the drive through? Like, I don't think I've seen people. Do that. So I timidly started walking towards the drive through to go through there and just walk up to the window with my check. Thankfully, my mom noticed where I was going prior to me getting there, so I didn't have to look like a total idiot just walking up to the window, knocking, and be like, hey, I got a, I got a check to cash. Let's do this. So <sighs> the retardations of children, sometimes it's, sometimes it's interesting. That story could have been potentially more exciting and stupid, but thankfully my mom saved me that from that. So thanks, mom. And fun fact... I like the fact that my car does, doesn't have electric windows. My car doesn't have electric windows or electric locks. And I like the fact that it doesn't have electric windows all because I think if I drive into a lake or some body of water one day, I can roll down my window manually and then I can swim out the window rather than worry about like when people try and roll down their windows and like the engine and all the electronics fry and you're like, oh no, I'm stuck in my car. And then it's hard to like open your door because of the water pressure though I think in order to do that you need to like wait till your car is flooded more and then you open it then there's no pressure but either way I mean I live in Arizona and there's not really any bodies of water where I'm at but for some reason I take solace in the fact that if I ever drive into a lake I can roll down my own window and then just swim out it because I can fit out my window <sighs> scenarios these are the things I think of one day I'm gonna be all prepared all up in here Anyway, you guys, thanks for watching. I'm going to go try and get the stalker working, um, and we'll see where we're at tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. Feel my power.